Whoopi Goldberg, host of The View, was aggressive with a crew member during a live television segment. The host greeted someone off-screen with ICU as the show transitioned to a commercial. The View panel discussed Congressman Kevin McCarthy's narrow three-vote defeat on Wednesday's broadcast. He believed he had won the election to be the Speaker of the House, therefore he had already moved his belongings into the office. The women all spoke so extensively that they had to switch to commercials since they were running behind schedule. Following the nearly eight-minute chat, Whoopi raised her voice and gestured toward the camera. Yes, you're here, she said. You're visible. With a feisty tone and a head shake, the host wished everyone a happy new year. After removing his mask and grinning, the crew member was captured on camera. There was a clap as Whoopi said, We'll be right back. Before cutting to a commercial break, the camera panned out to show the entire panel and then the audience. Crew members have been called out by Whoopi before. When she told them she sees them again in October, she caused yet another embarrassing moment on live. This occurred during a contentious hot topics discussion between the panelists and the moderator on the approaching midterm elections. Whoopi was chatting with 33-year-old Alyssa Farah Griffin, a newcomer to The View, about her opinions on surveys. I think polls are crazy because people coerce them into saying what they want to say at the right time and in the right way. I see you, the actor said to a crew member after calming down and turning away from the camera. I see you. The panelists chuckled before Anna Navarro carried on the discussion. In many states, the deadline for voter registration is today. Individuals should look at that. Register, she said. Yes, Whoopi repeated. They do. In reference to the crew member, she remarked, we will go get you that information when we come back because, the man with the blue card, pointing to the camera. Then, when the show jumped to its first commercial break, Whoopi waved her hand and the papers on her desk. That same day, Whoopi pleaded with a staff worker to go on to the next section, which she didn't enjoy. She urged a staff worker to move the show along at a rather awkward moment on The View, since she was obviously sick of dipping prosciutto ham in butter. Whoopi made it apparent that she found the panel's attempt at prosciutto with butter to be repulsive. You don't put prosciutto with butter. As her co-host Sunny Hostin objected, Whoopi yelled, No you gotta put. But the actress was not having any of it. The live crowd chuckled, so she shot out, No, 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 you don't put prosciutto with butter. What the? I'm pro butter board, but you do have to be cautious of double dippers. Alyssa then conceded. When the women were still chatting, Whoopi became irritated and yelled out to a staff member on stage, Is Gina Davis coming soon? In reference to their upcoming guest. When the live crowd started laughing once more, the crew member reassured Whoopi and she just replied, Okay. The TikTok craze of a butter board which looks like a charcuterie platter but uses butter in place of cheese, was ridiculed by viewers for Whoopi's disapproval. It's clear that Whoopi doesn't comprehend the butter board. She believes you grab globs of butter and eat that, a fan said. She doesn't comprehend that spreading butter from the board onto your bread is consenting. Gobs of butter, exclaimed another and included a gif of a laughing person. A third person added, Whoopi, the reason it's called a butterboard is because there is butter on it. You are free to write anything on it. It is comparable to a charcuterie board. The only restriction on what can be placed on it is that it must contain butter. Daytime television thrives on unpredictability. Moments of unscripted tension can electrify the airwaves, leaving viewers captivated and talking long after the credits roll. This was precisely the case during a recent episode of The View, when moderator Whoopi Goldberg had a tense interaction with a crew member just before cutting to a commercial break. The live moment, which quickly went viral, showcased Whoopi's sharp wit and unfiltered personality, but it also raised eyebrows among fans and critics alike. Was it just a momentary lapse in patience, 
Or did it hint at deeper issues behind the scenes of the long-running talk show? In this deep dive, we'll explore the context of the moment, reactions from viewers and insiders, and what it reveals about the pressures of live television and The View's dynamic cast. It was a regular morning on The View, with the panelists Whoopi Goldberg, Joy Bihar, Alyssa Farah Griffin, Sunny Hostin, and Anna Navarro, engaged in a spirited discussion on the topic of the day. The conversation, as usual, was lively, filled with humor, debate, and a touch of controversy. But as the discussion wound down and it was time to cut to a commercial break, Whoopi's demeanor shifted. A crew member, reportedly signaling her off-camera, appeared to disrupt her flow. Whoopi, clearly irritated, turned her attention toward the crew member and quipped, Can I finish what I'm saying, or do you want to host this show? Her voice carried an edge, though she maintained her composure. Without missing a beat, she followed up with, All right, fine, let's pay the bills, before transitioning to the break with her signature sarcasm. The exchange didn't go unnoticed by the show's live audience or its devoted viewers at home. Within minutes, clips of the moment began circulating on social media, sparking a flurry of reactions. Supporters praised Whoopi's quick wit. Whoopi is a queen. She doesn't hold back, and I love it. Honestly, the crew needs to let her do her thing. She's been running the show for years. Whoopi didn't need to snap like that. It's a team effort. Live TV is tough, but taking it out on the crew isn't a good look. The moment also inspired memes, with one popular image featuring Whoopi pointing off-camera captioned, Whoopi when someone interrupts her flow. For those unfamiliar with the mechanics of live TV, moments like these can seem jarring. However, they're often the result of intense behind-the-scenes pressure. Producers, directors, and crew members work tirelessly to ensure that live broadcasts run smoothly. Timing is everything, especially on a show like The View, which juggles panel discussions, guest segments, and commercial breaks within a tight schedule. Whoopi's role as the moderator adds another layer of responsibility. Not only does she steer the conversation among her co-hosts, but she also has to keep an eye on cues from the production team ensuring that transitions happen seamlessly. A source close to the show shed light on the moment. Whoopi is passionate about what she does, and sometimes that passion comes through in ways that seem intense. The crew understands that, and there's no bad blood. It's just the nature of live TV. Tensions aren't uncommon on The View. The show is known for its cast of strong-willed women, each with unique perspectives and personalities. While this dynamic is part of what makes the show compelling, it also means that clashes, both on and off camera, are inevitable. Whoopi, who has been with the show since 2007, often finds herself at the center of these moments. As the moderator, she's tasked with maintaining order and moving the show along, a role that requires her to balance diplomacy with decisiveness. Joy Bihar, the show's longest serving co host, once joked about the chaos of The View, saying, if you can survive a day here, you can survive anything. This isn't the first time Whoopi has had a fiery moment on The View. Over the years, her candid approach has led to a series of memorable unscripted exchanges. The Jeanine Pirro incident, 2018. Whoopi made headlines after a heated argument with Fox News personality Jeanine Pirro during a live interview. The conversation grew so intense that it reportedly continued off-camera. The Meghan McCain era. Whoopi often sparred with former co-host Meghan McCain, particularly during politically charged discussions. While the tension occasionally boiled over, it also made for gripping television. The pandemic pivot, 2020. During the height of the COVID-19 pandemic, The View transitioned to remote broadcasts. Technical glitches and communication challenges occasionally tested Whoopi's patience, resulting in a few viral moments. What drives moments like Whoopi's feisty exchange with the crew member? Psychologists suggest that high-pressure environments, combined with the human desire for control, 
can lead to reactive behavior. Dr. Emily Hart, a media psychologist, explains. Live television is a unique environment where mistakes are amplified and there's no room for second takes. Personalities like whoopies thrive in these spaces because they're quick thinkers, but that same trait can make them more prone to moments of frustration when things don't go as planned. The Role of the Audience The live studio audience also plays a role in shaping the energy of the show. Their reactions, whether laughter, applause, or silence, can influence the panelists' mood and responses. In this particular moment, the audience's nervous chuckles added a layer of awkwardness, amplifying the tension. For viewers at home, it was a reminder of the unpredictable nature of live television.